morning. Hope y'all are doing well. It is February 27th. In our devotional this morning, it says, Saved by grace. Matthew 26, verse 26 through 28. As they were eating, Jesus took bread, blessed and broke it, and gave it to the disciples, and said, Take, eat, this is my body. Then he took the cup and gave thanks, and gave it to them, saying, Drink from it, all of you, for this is my blood of the new covenant, which is shed for many for the remission of sins. John chapter 6, verse 33. The true bread of God is the one who comes down from heaven and gives life to the world. 1 Corinthians chapter 11, verse 26. Whenever you eat this bread and drink this cup, you proclaim the Lord's death until he comes. Luke chapter 22, verse 19 through 20. He took some bread and gave thanks to God for it. Then he broke it in pieces and gave it to the disciples, saying, This is my body, which is given for you. Do this in remembrance of me. After supper, he took another cup of wine and said, This is the cup of the new covenant between God and his people, an agreement confir confirmed with my blood, which is poured out as a sacrifice for you. And Colossians chapter 4, verse 6. Let your conversation be always full of grace, seasoned with salt, so that you may know how to answer everyone. And at the bottom, it says, In the upper room, Jesus instituted communion for those who struggled. While he was washing the, his disciples' feet, he knew they would run away. As he was dipping his bread in the bowl, he heard the clanking of 30 coins and betrayal. Even while Peter was speaking, he could hear the sound of a rooster crowing. Jesus knew for whom his body would be broken, and yet he gave communion. With communion, God says yes to those drowning in his grace. Eat the bread, drink the wine. You are saved. We are saved by his grace. He done so much. It touches my heart so much. He done so much for us. It touches my heart so much. Just thinking about the things that he's done for us. And I, I'm, I'm so unworthy. I'm so unworthy of what he done for me. But through his grace, we're all saved. I love you guys. As always, give me a thumbs up or thumbs down. Like, share, and subscribe. Okay. Things like this devotional this morning, it touches my heart and gets me emotional. Sometimes it's hard to believe that somebody can do that much for an old wretched sinner like me. He, and he done so much. I can never, ever repay him and what he's done for me. But I love him. And I can't wait, can't wait to get to heaven to see him. I love you guys. And I hope you have a very blessed day. And if I don't see you in the next video, I hope to see you in heaven.